On Sunday, September 22, from 2 p.m. to 5 p.m. local time, we will be diving into the Oranguru and Peshimian Research Day. For those who are new to the game, Research Days are a special events where a particular Pokemon takes center stage. Appearing more frequently in the wild, these events are packed with the following bonuses. Increased spawn rates, the featured Pokemon will be easier to find than usual, exclusive field research, unique tasks that reward encounters with the featured Pokemon, shining chances, the shiny version of the Pokemon may be more likely to appear, bone rewards, Extra starters or XP can make your adventure even more rewarding. Your Anguru and Passimi Research Day will take place on Sunday, September 22. You will have a 3 hour window to explore, catch and collect from 2 pm to 5 pm on your local time. The star of this event are Oranguru and Passimian. These two Pokemon will be the focus of the Research Day event. While Oranguru's shiny forms has already been released, Passimian will make its shiny debut during this event. To add this shiny Pokemon to your collection, you will need to complete the specific field research tasks. But that's not all. During the Rushes Day, other wild Pokemon will be appearing more frequently. These Pokemon are Monkey, Apun, Slackwat, Shimshar and Rookie. Keep in mind that all the previous Pokemon can be shiny except Rookie. As usual, there will be a paid research task. For $2, you will get an egg vent exclusive time research. This time research will challenge you to complete field research tasks to encounter with more Oranguru and Passimian. Are these Pokemon any good? While Oranguru and Passimian aren't the top tier PvP contenders, the event is primarily about collecting and shiny hunting. The only Pokemon with a significant PvP potential among the increased spawns is Monkey, whose evolution, Primeape, is a solid Ultra League chase. Get ready to walk. This research day is all about exploring and hitting up spooky stops. So choose a location with plenty of both. Parks and densely populated areas are great options. Preparation is key. Make sure you have enough storage for your Pokemon, plenty of Pokeballs and any other essential like berries. If you have incense or lures, now is the time to use them. Focus on field research tasks. These tasks are the best bet for encountering Aranguru and Passimi. Completing them will reward you with encounters and other goodies. Maximize your chances. Use lures and incense to attract Pokemon to real location. And consider using Lucky X and Star Piece to boost your XP and Stardust gains. A Pokemon Go Plus or a gotcha can help you automate the catching process. While this research day might not be massive as the others, I will definitely be playing until I snag the shiny Pokemon that I'm missing. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below how you feel about the event and which shiny Pokemon you are you hoping to catch. If you're enjoying this video, be sure to check my other Pokemon Go content. Don't forget to subscribe for more exciting updates. See you in the next one.